beauties welcome to the pika makeup hope you all are in super great so let's see how to create this beautiful gold eye makeup i'm gonna first start with applying foundation all over my face i'm using wet n wild photo focus foundation in desert page if you want to know my thoughts on the foundation powder and also concealer please check out the description box for the link when i'm using the concealer from the same line i'm going to apply this under my eyes i'm also going to highlight the high points of my face and blend this all in with a damp sponge. Then I'm going to take the powder again from Wet n Wild Photo Focus line and I'm going to apply this all on my face to set the base makeup that I have applied. Then I'm going to fill in my eyebrows with It Cosmetics Brow Power Universal Brow Pencil. I'm going to first sketch out my eyebrows, fill them in and then blend it out with the spoolie. Moving on to eye makeup, I'm first going to apply shadow primer and this is going to ensure that my eye makeup will stay on for a longer time without creasing. Then I'm using Juvia's Place Masquerade Mini Palette. I'm going to take the shade Burkina which is a matte brown eyeshadow and I'm going to use this as my transition color and I'm going to blend this almost to nothing. Then I'm going to take the shade Giza and I'm going to apply this under my eyebrows and also in my inner corner. Then I'm going to go back and forth with the shades Zulu and Fulani to deepen up my outer corner and crease. Then I'm going to apply the shade Casablanca with my finger all over my eyelid and then i'm going to take a damp brush to intensify that eyeshadow this is a very pigmented eyeshadow but i just wanted that foiled look on my eyelid then with the blending brush i'm going to blend away all the harsh edges and then i'm going to use the same shades that we applied on the eyelid to smoke out my lower lash line if you want to know my thoughts on this palette, stay tuned. I will update the link in the description box below. Then I'm going to tight line my eyes with my favorite cool pencil. This is Essence Long Lasting Cool Kajal. And I'm going to apply this in my low waterline and my upper waterline. Then with Physicians Formula Eye Booster Eyeliner. I'm going to line my upper lash line and wing out as I normally would do. Then I'm going to finish off my eye makeup with some mascara. I'm layering CoverGirl Plumpify Mascara followed by BH Cosmetics Mascara just to add some length and volume. Again, I'm going to layer two blushes. First, I'm going to add Wet n Wild's Apricot in Metal. And even though this is glowy, I just needed some more color. So I'm just adding the Essence Peach Blush on top, just a little bit for some color. And I'm going to take Wet n Wild Contour Palette in Caramel Toffee. And I'm going to take the contour side and apply this in the hollows of my cheekbone jawline temples of my face and i'm also going to use this to contour my nose now the cheeks have enough highlight from the wet n wild blush but to highlight the high points of my face i'm using ofra cosmetics and dupe that highlighter in the shade you do you Then I'm going to line my lips with Tarte Tarte's lip liner in Latogram and do not recommend this lip liner. It is not smooth enough, it tugs on my lips and it is not pigmented. Mm -hmm. 
and then as my lipstick I'm using Rimmel Show Off Lip Lacquer in the shade Aurora. And that completes this video. Stay tuned for more videos with Julia's Place eyeshadow palette. If you enjoyed this video and found this video helpful, do not forget to like, comment and share. And also subscribe to my channel. You can also follow me on my social media. I am Deepika Makeup Everywhere. Stay tuned for more videos and I will see you all very very soon in my next video. Goodbye.